Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to City Skylines. We're second attempt and I'm working on, you know, doing better this time basically. Come on, out there, yes, good. Now, the I think the main problem that we had last time was basically that we had this and it went you know, into the city. We needed more on our fronts, which is what I've done here. And at the moment, yeah, we're using the normal one ways, but I'll probably change these up to... Well, I am going to change them up to highways and stuff once we get up to there. But I'm happy to go a little... Oh, no, not slower. I'm happy not necessarily to grow as quick as I did last time. Oh, crap. What did we unlock? Garbage? Okay, what I'm going to do with garbage is take a two-way here. Run it off a bit. And place it there. It should still cover... No, it's covering the entirety of the city yet. There we go. And it's healthcare, which is the other building, which we need 10 grand for. So let's save up a little bit. And what I should probably do is keep enough for a wind turbine in stock because, you know, power's needed. But yeah, I'm not going to keep zoning, you know, just because we have demand. Because I think what I did last time is I grew too quickly and I didn't have the money to buy everything that we needed. Despite the fact you get like a, a chunk of money when you s go up a level. Sometimes it's probably better to... I mean, that chunk is probably to cover the new stuff that you need. Not getting the stuff that you missed out last time. Yeah, at the moment, I, I'm curious how long I could stay with these roads you know, before I went to the highways. But that's basically what this is, isn't it? That's, that's It's a highway by another name. A two-lane highway. And I'm leaving the gap there because it makes it easier to get on and off. Because you know, when we're on the other side, you see how like from here I did 2 miss 2-2? Two, two? Well then hopefully, uh, that's an on. Well, I could have an on joining in from the other side as well. <laughs> and that's an off. So we can have these junctions and have multiple ways on and off. So they'll use all three lanes because that seems to be the problem at the moment yeah they might prefer to use one lane over another and i think if well if they have options for all three of them you know like each junction then at least they'll use the one that they want okay everything's going up we've got a lot of demand for commercial act uh, residential actually so i might want to expand i think what i'll do is i'll connect that just all the way down here and finish that little bit off not a, not, a, not a large amount, but... What do you mean space already occupied? Well, we'll have to give that a little kink. But it's fine, it makes it look a little bit more natural. And... I don't... Really want them on that road just yet. So actually, that's going to be tiny amount of housing space, but it's something. They're moving in. Let's see, they've all got the cars parked on the road there. I mean, we're making money. We're making about a tenth of what the other city was making. And we have a population of less than 10% of that. Well, less than 10% of that. What's the next goal? Because ideally, I want to creep up to that without going into it for a bit so we can, you know, get some more money. So I'm thinking... I maybe zone. We've got some room for some more commercial, but I don't really want to put commercial there. I want to keep the space for noise pollution. So, oh yeah, new service. I haven't built the clinic yet. And putting the clinic here is covering everything. It's on one of the main roads through, but they shouldn't be going on this road that much. They will for now because of the same speed, but once this is a highway, even getting from, like, here to here, they'll probably prefer to jump on the highway and come off because it's going to be quicker roads. Or at least I'm hoping that they're going to do that. But you don't have water? For Christ's sake. There, a special water pipe for the hospital. And does that connect the power grid up? It does, so I can demolish... A few more of you. Still need to keep that one for now. But might want to put a little park there maybe. I can't build parks yet. 
I was going to say a little something there, though. Connect that power grid up. And, yeah, so I can get rid of these and save a little bit more money again. Let's come out of here. How are we looking on power, actually? Plenty good enough at the moment. Water still more than enough. I mean, we're paying half, so we're only getting like 25% of what we can actually handle. And, yeah, we're only at half of that capacity. So we're at like an eighth of what we could do. So we're only spending half the money. It's not efficient money-wise, but we'd be wasting it anyway. So we might as well waste it this way and save a little bit more. See, now that's curves there. I think I'm going to mimic it with the next road that I build. So let's get the free fall. The start of this song reminds me of the Crusader Kings. Is it, or an EU4 song. I can't remember which one it is. It might be EU4, actually. So have you come out this way a bit and then round? No. So as if you're going straight to here. No, it's... I didn't want you to actually place it. I was still working on where I wanted you. So I haven't quite worked it out. And that curve's almost perfectly matching that with its, you know, horrible straight lines. Yeah, so it does break up the blocks a bit. So it's probably not actually as space efficient as what well, that straight line and that curve there was. But it'll look a little bit more natural, I hope. I'm going to go up to this block here. A little bit more space. So it's not grids. You should all have water. And I want to stay just under there. So we're getting close. I probably don't want to zone much more. Is the Twitch chat broken or are you just being really quiet, guys? Yeah, from here, services for the small one should be able to cover, like, all the way down to this main road. So I'm hoping that's going to be enough. But we do want some more commercial. And I think commercial along this side here will look good. The only problem is, it's going to cause a lot of traffic. It's not the best place to be putting it. Ah, just being quiet, good. At least I know that it's working. Well, hell, if you're being quiet, then, you know, how am I going to know where anyone else is there? <laughs> you're normally the one that makes a noise. But, hopefully, local industry can service them along that road there. So, I actually do probably want a secondary road coming here. I, I, I like the idea of a commercial there, but it just doesn't... It's just going to cause too many problems. So, let's instead... Just stretch this out a little bit more. And for the time being, you know, fill that up there. And it'll also help me get rid of some of them power lines. No, don't, these own. Don't go on that side yet. Just stay in here. Give me a little bit more time. You know, at this small size. Get a little bit more money. We've got people coming in for work. I, think it's balance. I don't think demand is necessarily the best thing to gauge when you should be building. Yo, unless it gets like really high. I, last time what I was doing was building as soon as there was any demand whatsoever. I think what you should maybe do is only build residential when one of these two is complaining about you know, not having enough. And actually we can get rid of some more power lines of the other thing. Time? Uh, sorry, what do you mean by time? I can't actually get rid of that. It still doesn't connect. So I need some sort of building there. Hmm. <laughs> Topic seems to work not well there. By the bots. If they don't expand the power enough. Actually, I can... Let's change the connection to here and here. Does that connect? It does, so I can get rid of the others. That's good. Because they're not really the most efficiently placed. Yeah, there was just two places. And yeah, can see, now they're complaining about, yo, know, not having enough workers. 
So I feel okay at putting in some more... More residential now. And although I've already got it zoned, I want to... I'm going to go straight for a little bit and then I'm going to go to the free form. And curve it in a little bit. And not that much. Why do you suddenly tick? Uh, stop locking so badly. Just want a little curve. A little curve. Oh, there. It's a little bit of a curve. It sort of hides the, the kink that we have, like, very big kink there. Oh, I said time. God, what did I mean by time? Yeah, let's fill in another one of these blocks. I think this is actually going to tick us over the 700. And into the next category. Almost certainly. Like, there's going to be more than 25 people. <laughs> actually, to be honest, we're building one house. Two houses... Three, maybe four? Is that going to take these four houses? going to take me over 20... Oh, no, wait. That's a semi-detached, so that's four houses there. And you can't tell me there's not room for a house for... <laughs> yeah. About five houses. You're putting one way, the rest two way. Ah, uh, I have to check that. Sorry I, if I've messed that up. Yeah, five houses is apparently 25 people. Actually, no, yeah, maybe five people living there. Okay, so I've been building... Yeah, that's one way. Sorry, my mistake. That's still one way. That's still one way. That's a two-way good, yeah. I wanted two-way. Let's build you out as a full block and then switch to the curve and see if I can't. You have to behave a little bit more like I want. That's basically straight. Uh, anyway, it's not straight because it's not efficient. But have I built stupid one ways anywhere else? Gotta look at the road signs to guess that. No, it's just that one. Okay. We've got some more resis moving in. What's the next goal? 1,000 or 100. So I can probably... Safely zone to the end of the road there. And I'll zone in that block there as well. That should keep me well below the mark. And what is it that we just unlocked? Fire, which we know instantly is going to cause problems. And I'm going to put the fire station. It's not brilliant for the residential. It's not quite covering all of it. So I need to start getting a bit more down here. But this is what causes most of the fire. And this is also going to mean I can get rid of the um, little bit connection that we had there. And police. Place you there. I'm actually good coverage on the opposite to the hospital. So can I now get rid of them poles? I can. Brilliant. So I want to put, find a building to put there just so I can get it. So we've got the fire and the police plopped down. So that's what we gained at the start of this level. Yeah, you should have power. Oh, you don't have water, do you? Because the way I built these... There we go. You have water now. We come out. Okay, so we are growing. Don't want to grow too quickly. I'm trying to you know, stick just below the thing. Uh, 1,100 we can build Heldwarf School, can we? Oh, crap, school. Uh, elementary. Education. And um, we need power. So let's sort power out first. I know I can set districts. I don't want to just yet. Sixers. Right, they're going to complain probably about the noise. But this should mean that I can get rid of... I can only get like a six round here anyway. Actually, there only the fire station should complain about the noise. And I think that'll still connect the networks up. Yes, so I can get rid of almost all of them power lines now. There we go. And it's just the stupid ones all the way up there, which we're struggling, struggling with. But elementary school. We need to build one, and it costs 10 grand. I don't have enough. 
This is why I don't want to get to the high numbers straight away. You know, want to try and earn money and not necessarily need all of it just yet. How's water looking? Water availability isn't good. But treatment is? Did I not turn treatment down? Is treatment a separate slider? Well, let's take you up to 75 and check the water again. Okay, try again to turn it up. Let's just set it to 100. Yeah, brilliant. More than enough. More than enough for ages. Actually, I could have got away with... I, I've sorted water now. Stop complaining. I sorted it before you even complained. Yeah, Hell Dwarf is a high school. So we won't... Uh, we'll make sure he still is a high school. And I think we'll have the elementary school in that actually along here. Oh, this is probably actually what I'll save this for. More services. We do need an elementary school first. Oh, I'm going up the slow speed. This is why I don't seem to be getting any money. Time's going too slow. I, I, I keep getting thinking, oh yeah, well my road works, you know, is going well. We haven't got any, um, you know, bottlenecks or anything yet. But yeah, we only have like 750 people living here. I think I'm safe to zone some more without yet getting close to going to the next level. So let's... Zoning this. I think we should be safe with that. Might be a little bit much, actually. Seems to be about five people per house. Ish. Obviously not, because you don't end up with a round number of five, but... Actually, no, I can get away with a good bit more zoning. So let's... I'm going to have to go to the small to finish this off. Get you in there. You're still on this road, so tiny little houses to be put in there, and you can have a little bit of an expansion, maybe. But yeah, time to work on this road. I think that will just be straight. Yeah, but we disconnected the power by doing that. Nothing's quite reaching to that side. It's not efficient, but I'm going to do it that way, then I don't have to worry about accidentally knocking it down again. And get rid of these. Or I will as soon as I build that road. It sounds like we've already got... Oh wait, fire, fire, fire! Put it out. I do like how there's actual people turn up to put it out. Wait, is that one way? No, 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 there are two ways. Everything's a two-way. I think. Yeah, everything's a two-way. It's, it's going fine. Demand. We're up to 800. Let's chuck in a bit more. Um, filling this side of a road, I think. With what we did last time, you know, and how sort of like little population went up, I think we can get away with that. Money's coming in. Making so little, though, because I've got, you know, coverage of the buildings is too good. So, actually, yeah, I do need to grow. Get a bit more tax income. And we've got room for commercials, so let's expand the commercial districts. And I don't really want you perfectly straight. So, let's... Just curve you in a little bit. See, I like that. They're basically still straight roads. You was driving down them, you'd think they were straight roads. But just them little... That wiggle, I think, makes it look more realistic. The feeder system. Oh, these are all one-ways, yes. But this is a two-way. Let's get some more commercial in. There we go. The building sort of straight away as I place it, which is a good sign. And 
we're going to want some more industrial. And the industrial I am going to build a perfect straight road. What are you complaining about? Adults too. Are you just complaining about something for a second then? One way bad. No, these are good. These are basically on and off ramps. You can't have two way on off ramps. This is a highway. This is a two lane highway. Two lanes everywhere. <laughs> Not two way, two lanes. It really annoys me that you don't start off with control of this. I can still see that becoming a problem. Unemployment in the city is high, zone more industrial. Well, you say that, but nobody's complaining about unemployment. But when I tend to build, like, to industrial demand, they do then claim that there's not enough people to work there. Yeah, industrial will get an actual just pure straight road. I will zone a little bit more. Um, let's do my K. One, two, three, four. That should be enough. See, there's no residential demand at the moment. I think that's because of the unemployment. But I don't necessarily want to build that quick again. I mean, last time I rushed up the levels. <laughs> um, the uh, Crusader Kings 2, most of the Let's Plays I tend to do once a week. Okay, we're running low on power again. City's Skyline has got a bit of a bonus this time because it's new and shiny. And basically new and shiny, I wanted to play it. Uh, 60 sort of beginning going to be the best that we can get. So I'll just cram him down here. There we go. I'd love to just place him down in this middle bit. Because there's not really much there. But I don't think the wind is all that good there. No, we get down to like 4 megawatts. I mean, 6 there, but it covered the industrial. And I don't think they'd like that. And it's still basically all we've got is industrial demand. So let's, let's block in another bit. One, two, three, four. So let's go two blocks worth. Go crazy. Because this is where we'll probably make money. You know how I built the blocks? Perfect size of them buildings? Yep. New game, shiny disc. <laughs> I, I really do enjoy city skylines. Uh, well, if I say that, this is only my second city. <laughs> I've played a grand total of four hours. Which to me seems like a lot because that's, you know, almost, almost 100% of the games I play, I've played either recorded or streamed. I don't really tend to play games sort of by myself, if that makes any sense. And um, four hours is a lot. You know, when people say like um, a, a Rumba, Quill, Northern Line of that lot, when they're talking about, oh yeah, I'm they're starting their Let's Play, they're like, they had access to it however long beforehand. And it's like, oh yeah, well I... um. I've only got like 20 hours into the game. I'm like, yeah, 20 hours? That's that's a lot. <laughs> I usually come into games and I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. We're getting a bit of residential demand. I want to keep... I don't really care about industrial demand. What I care about is not letting it get so high that the residential demand disappears. Oh, we haven't done districts yet. No. Let's get the big one. It's just... So much easier to sort of like blob big ones. And I'm going to need names. So ladies and gentlemen in the chat, sort of like start suggesting names. Uh, we'll leave these ones up for now, but... Sort of guess what they're for. Yeah, but that's a... Industrial entrance, a sort of... Commercially zone, which we'd need a name for. And a residentially zone, which we'd need a name for. We're to a thousand. We're slowly ticking. Actually, somehow we're slowly ticking up. Still, you know, gaining more people, even though we're not. I think we can get away with a little bit more with this without sort of like killing everything. So let's go across four. Build. Oh, I dezoned. No, I want to zone, not dezone. I can't dezone that thing there. There was nothing there in the first place. 
more of a big block straight away. Blind LP equal good. LP. Yes. <laughs> I'm glad you think that because that's basically all of my LPs. Although, I remember on the, um, a Dr. Nick Doom channel, which was my original one before I moved to House Doom 1, I did a, uh, Fallout 3 Let's Play, and it was blind. I, I'd seen a bit of Quill 18's New Vegas Let's Play, so I sort of understood the mechanics, uh, but instantly people are going, this ain't a blind Let's Play, this ain't a blind Let's Play, so I don't write that on there anymore, but basically all of what I do, unless obviously I've got earlier Let's Plays of it, is a blind sort of thing. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's on YouTube. Uh, that's all the time we have for today. As always, I'd like to thank you for watching. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to say goodbye. Goodbye.